This presentation is on Gate Driver Solutions from Power Integrations. My name is Andrew Smith, I'm Director of Training at Power Integrations, and today we're going to talk about various gate drivers available from our high power group, and we'll start with plug and play gate drivers. A plug and play gate driver is a gate driver designed to work with a specific switch, both electrically and mechanically. The aim is to reduce the cost of ownership by creating a solution you simply connect to your system. This gives you a faster time to market, especially in high power applications above 1200 volts. You can see a plug and play board mounted on a switch module and you can see that it's exactly matched to the shape of the switch. That is a plug and play solution. Plug and play applications include power grid, Things like Statcom and power distribution require switching. That's where plug and play solutions are extremely useful. Railway, traction and motion, light rail, those kind of things also suit the plug and play market. Medium voltage drives for industrial applications, DC fast charging for automotive, wind, solar and other alternative energy sources. All of these are applications where large amounts of power are shifted around a system and require switches, which is very well suited to the large um, deployment of plug and play modules. The nice thing about a plug and play gate driver is it provides proven performance and gives you a, a much quicker time to get into the market. Because you're matched to the switches, the Electrical performance is ideal for that switch without any modification. And things like the Econo Dual, the Prime Pack 3 and 3 Plus, the IHV, Press Pack, and the other types of switch bodies are managed with a unique solution for each. It provides very safe and reliable operation. You get reinforced or basic insulation according to what the IEC standards ask for. You get protection against uh, over, over voltage or short circuit advanced active clamping um, or dynamic advanced active clamping de depending on the module you choose. They're also qualified to the relevant application standards giving comprehensive EMC and environmental testing and results built into that solution. We can also add value add services to improve reliability in, in some applications. Conformal coating uh, provides environmental protection, very useful in wind power which is uh, sometimes in very exposed environments. Um, we can also do burn-in to eliminate early life failures. So we expose the product to switching for a period of time and uh, eliminate any early life failure. We can use plug and play gate drivers for IGBT blocking voltages between 600 volts and 6,500 volts. Plug and play gate drivers provide the best performance versus conventional solutions. They have a very small propagation delay, which means you can precisely control the inverter output current. It doesn't require dead time compensation or filtering, so you automatically have the optimized solution for your application. There's comprehensive protection built into the devices. As I mentioned, they've got short circuit protection, so you get protection against catastrophic failure and over voltage protection. Also, we have short circuit current limiting. So you get reduced stress for, say, an IGBT module, and you also limit the short circuit energy. In addition, we get protection against catastrophic overvoltage in normal operation. This gives very high MTBF, and the integration means we have a reduced bill of material, which further helps reliability and lifetime. The solution can be customized to provide tailored performance to match the customer's requirement and we start with an existing product and we modify it accordingly. This means we can get application specific optimization for matching reliability, efficiency and functionality requirements unique to each customer. The other thing that's really nice is you get a reduced time to market. Your design resources are not tied up developing your gate driver. A single plug and play board is a standalone solution. It works for your application right out of the box. No sub-assemblies, reduced component count. It's a very simple process, which helps you maximize the use of your resources. 
An example of a success story was for a large EU wind customer. This customer designed an application to provide wind power from an ocean-based application. We designed a custom solution based from the customer's target specification, and we developed a product that matched the customer interface, was very highly integrated, had a custom environmental and EMC qualification and protection features specifically for that application. We have gate driver modules in plug and play format for the common power modules. Infineon, Mitsubishi, Hitachi, Fuji, Infineon, Danfoss, these kind of manufacturers are covered by our plug and play solution. This is a list um, in table form of some of the modules that we have available. So we have the Scale iFlex plug and play gate driver for the new 100 times 140 millimeter dual modules. This is for both IGBTs and silicon carbide. It's made for very easy paralleling of up to four modules. There's high power dual modules in the market from Infineon, Mitsubishi, Hitachi, ABB and Fuji and others. These are all supported by the Scale iFlex concept. For paralleling of multiple modules in a very cost-sensitive application, we have Scale iFlex Lite. This is a really flexible solution and it's suitable for things like photovoltaic, wind uh, and similar applications. You can parallel up to six Econodule 3 or equivalent semiconductor modules with one of these devices. It provides very good ruggedness against noise and emitter cross currents. It has comprehensive pr protection, advanced active clamping for over voltage protection and it does desaturation detection to detect short circuits and then provides protection from those events. Samples of this technology will be available in Q1 of 2021. In addition, we have new products coming to support railway applications. The IHM and IHV modules for up to 6.5 kV blocking voltage will be available. They really increase mechanical robustness, which is important because in a railway application, there's a lot of bending and vibration stress this provides very strong solutions using thick PCB material, excellent connectors to provide the mechanical robustness you require in this market space. In addition, there'll be conformal coating provided for these devices and burn-in to eliminate early failures. If you need some more information, if you have an automotive uh, customer or a railway application, please contact your PI representative for more information. So let's talk for a moment or two about value added services. Power integrations can offer conformal coating and burn in. I've mentioned that in the description of some of our plug and play gate driver modules. We can also provide a five year warranty if a product is conformally coated. In addition, we can do burn in, 23 hour burn in profile, and we can do custom setups upon request. Those are further detailed in some application flyers that you can obtain from power integrations. Let's move on and talk about our IC based products, Scale iDriver. So Scale iDriver is an IC family. It covers different applications using basic Scale iDriver building block specifically modified for each of those applications. It's very good for driving silicon carbide MOSFETs or IGBTs for um, working voltages below 1200 volts. The Scale I driver is designed for applications below about 250 kilowatts, which could be motor drives, UPS, solar, um, off-board charging, uh, EV and commercial vehicles, perhaps even welding and plasma cutting type industrial applications. So it has a wide range of utility in the marketplace. So the Scale I driver family supports IGBTs and silicon MOSFETs between 600 and 1200 volts. It's galvanically isolated, a single channel device, and it's a premium product. It's not intended to compete with low power below 250 watt type uh, gate driver sets. It provides reinforced isolation at 1200 volts, and that's by the FluxLink technology that some of you may be familiar with from our inner switch products. It doesn't require a secondary isolation barrier because of the nature of the isolation. 
It's also meeting reinforced isolation on a system level according to VDE and IEC standards. We have 9.5 millimeters of creepage and clearance between the input and output, and the material is rated at CTI of 600. This means you get really good isolation in your application. It has comprehensive protection and safety features. It has short circuit protection, under voltage lockout, on both the primary and the secondary side. It also gives a readout notification on the primary side of over voltage limiting and short circuit detection. So if one of those functions activates, it sends a warning message back to the controller. It also uses the advanced active clamping process um, uh, for more protection. The AEC Q100 range is automotive qualified. This is a simplified schematic of a flux link circuit. The flux link IC will provide 8 kV of surge insulation. It's certified to VDE 0884-10 and IEC 61800 for 1200 volts of reinforced insulation and 1700 volts of basic isolation. As you can see, the schematic is very simple. There's a power transfer mechanism using a transformer because scale eye driver is a signal path, not a power path. You provide input to the primary side and that is translated to the secondary side gate driver for both high side and low side drive. Internal level shifting means that you can simplify your power supply requirement. You'll notice that it only uses a single voltage rail. In addition, the scale eye driver can communicate from the secondary side back to the primary side to provide signal outputs in the event of a system failure or warning event. The scale eye driver combines magneto-inductive coupling with the functionality of our scale 2 technology used in some of our other products. It takes low voltage primary information, provides drive to a high voltage secondary. There are several scale eye driver families, all using the same basic technology of FluxLink and the same package capabilities, which provide good distance through insulation of greater than 0.4 millimeters, extended creepage and clearance, and the excellent CTI capability of 600. They can deliver a maximum gate power of 1.8 watts, and that'll drive an 8 amp or a 5 amp application, depending on the size of the device in the family. Comprehensive protection is provided for each of the products in the family, both primary and secondary, as I mentioned. They also have a rail-to-rail -rail stabilized voltage, which makes the delivery of an auxiliary power system to power the secondary side very much more straightforward. The SIC1182 is designed to drive silicon carbide MOSFETs up to 1200 volts. It has comprehensive protection. It provides the integrated flux link isolation. It can switch up to 150 kilohertz. It gives eight amps of gate driving and is fully qualified for the application. Silicon carbide MOSFETs require specific driver characteristics. It needs a very fast short circuit detection and turn off because silicon carbide MOSFETs are much faster than IGBTs. So we can provide with the scale eye driver two to four microsecond turn off times. Typically an IGBT will require 10 microseconds of shutdown time. This device will take care of that problem in two microseconds. But it also avoids false triggering due to oversensitivity. This is important because you don't want, with a very fast protection circuit, the device reacting incorrectly to transient events. It also has a negative turnoff gate voltage, which varies according to the MOSFET type. Unlike IGBTs, there is no common market standard yet for silicon carbide. So we need to make that capability flexible, and that's the capability of this device family. Secondary side under voltage lockout matches silicon carbide MOSFET requirements. There's more information in this in application note 1601, and you can also find out how to provide a substitute for the internal VEE regulator when adjusting our voltage of operation. The scale eye driver provides excellent value for driving silicon carbide MOSFETs. It provides that configurable gate drive capability and has the fast short circuit protection advanced active clamping 
and it also has that sense readout that gives you information about the cause of a failure. It's very small, so it reduces space on the circuit board and reduces component count. And because it's a really well-tested and developed product, and it also allows you to accelerate your time to market, providing a shortening of design time by up to two months, we have product information and reference designs available to help with that process. It can provide up to eight amps of gate drive current, integral within the device. It doesn't need an external circuit to generate that level of gate driver current. It can switch it up to 150 kilohertz. Because we have the comprehensive protection and reliability, it also means you get increased, increased reliability and you get reinforced isolation from FluxLink. One device can do a wide range of applications. So it's really flexible and it's ideal for platform solutions. This is a complete IGBT half bridge. As you can see, it's got two scale eye drivers and a transformer between primary and secondary. The two scale eye driver modules are identical, providing high side and low side gate drive from an appropriate input drive signal. The Q designation for a scale eye driver indicates that it's for automotive applications. It has the flux link galvanic isolation as all the, as all the scale eye drivers do. It provides a 650 to 1200 volt IGBT or silicon MOSFET module compatibility and provides reinforced isolation up to the 5,000 meter altitude that's required in automotive applications. It also provides 1200 volts of reinforced isolation and provides a le added level of security in that 100% isolation testing is carried out during production at 8 kV. Bi-directional communication is provided by FluxLink and it will operate in automotive temperature ranges of minus 40 to plus 125 degrees C. We meet the automotive qualification requirements with this product. It's AEC Q100 qualified. Scale High Driver ICs provide the building block for very high reliability integrated solutions. They provide excellent systems for power quality, EV charges, e buses and e trucks, industrial drives, and other applications. They provide very safe isolation for semiconductors up to about 1200 volts blocking voltage using FluxLink. We also have dedicated Q100 automotive qualified devices and silicon carbide MOSFET compatible scale eye drivers as well. The whole family reduces component count and that helps you increase reliability in your end application. I hope this has been helpful as an introduction to power integrations capabilities for high voltage gate driving. You can find out more information by visiting us on the web at www.power.com. Thank you very much.